What's up, UBA? This is Smash coming to you from Augusta, Georgia, home of the Deep South District's tour stop today. It's position round, so it's going to be a lot of excitement going on today. Well, Stay tuned to check out all the action with us. Uh, Cam, Marvell, EK, and then uh, 14 will be Nick, Jamel, and Brandon. This is Jamel, Jamel out of Alabama. 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 Being from Alabama today. That's what I'm talking about. Definitely. Roll time. Definitely throw that in the tour. Definitely We had some low scores last week, and we had some, and they came right back with their high scores, or vice versa. But the main thing about it is we had a good team win last week. So. Right. You already know. So that's all you want to say. Competitive, bring it in real quick. Hey, one thing I'm gonna say, for y'all that don't know me, I go by Smooth, aka Jamel. Hey man, we gonna have fun. Uh, I like to talk shit. Oh yeah, so, I brought so, him to talk some shit. So, so, so I'm gonna tell you like this: if we not having fun, we not both. If we not having fun, we not both. Man, behind it, Shannon. Outside is on three. Outside is on three. One, two, three. Outside. Have the most watched UBA bowling YouTube video. That's right. That's right. That's right. Yeah, so that's very important. Okay. Too. Okay. All right. So we're here with Daphne. Um, Daphne, how'd y'all do game one? Um, I think we won every game. They're still finishing up the handicap two pair, but we won the scratch and handicap one, and I'm pretty sure we got the third pair too. So. So it's safe to say y'all gonna jump uh, to number one after today. Is that what you're thinking? I hope so. We we'll just gotta keep with the transition. Hope we can keep striking. Okay. Take the win. Yeah, like, I, like I said, that um, you passed number one YouTube video now. All right. So we like we love that. I know that's pretty cool. And uh, keep watching. <laughs> yeah, we'll keep you keep winning. We'll keep watching. Uh, good luck the rest of the way today, and uh, and then we'll see you next month. All right. Thanks. Yes, ma'am. Monty, he's the uh, owner of Carolina Gatekeepers. Um, Monty, first year in the UVA uh, for your franchise. Tell, uh, tell us what, tell us about you. Tell us about the Carolina Gatekeepers. Well, the Carolina Gatekeepers consists of bowlers from Greenville, uh, Columbia, and like little small little outside areas. And starting off pretty good so far, and we plan on ending up pretty good. Um, so, what would you tell people that are uh, new to the UVA and like wanting to start a franchise? Man, tell, tell me about that. Like, how's that part going for you? Uh, first of all, you need to get people that like each other, people that love the bowl, people that don't mind trash talking, and have a financial background to make sure you're good. All right, so we're here with Martrell from The Outsiders, um, new franchise, uh, second year. So tell us about that experience, man. Tell me about your team. Show me the jersey. Like I like the the, the jacket you got going there. Like you, like you a letter. Need to. Yeah, I had to get a letter, man. You know, I had to be different. You know, you know the outsiders. Um, we we second year, a lot of learning experiences from last year. Definitely improved. Um, stepped up the competition. Had to go out and recruit and get some dogs. And, and turn the little puppies we had into dogs, but we're learning, we're getting it right this year, so I'm, I'm excited for, to see the end of the, re the rest of the season. So how's your season going right now? Like, what's, what number are you guys today? Um, that's a very good question. I think we're in the middle. I think we're number seven. Number seven? Okay, who y'all bowling? Uh, Augusta Rain, again, in Augusta. Uh, oh, that sounds like a little home field advantage for him, huh? Too much. This is, this is the third time we done faced them in Augusta. Well, you said you got dogs now, so they're gonna bark? Oh, oh you gonna hear them today. You gonna hear them today? Hear them today. Cam cameras out, dogs out.
who's uh, owner, president, CEO, all that good stuff. And Leonard Freeman, how you doing today, man? I'm here. So Leonard is here. He's in the building. He's got the jersey on. He's bowling, I'm guessing. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Really appreciate it. Feel the love. Yep. So uh, Bufu is uh, number 10 in the district. We're number nine in the district. So that's why we got the little heads up thing going today. Yeah. Uh, What's up? Yeah, we suck, but we do all both do pretty good on the team rankings. Apparently so. That's where all the money's at. Hey, I mean, y'all still gotta beat me. That's right. Everybody. Hi, hit man. So we still got some action going on there. Um, what y'all? How you? What y'all gonna do today? I know you. you don't tell me you know you're gonna win because we know you're gonna say that. What's the count gonna be? Twenty-one nineteen, just because I'm a jerk. Twenty-one and nineteen. That don't do us any good though. Hey, a win's a win. A win is a win. All right, cool. Well, good luck to y'all today and uh, the rest of the season, man. Yeah, same, same, same to y'all. Oh, yeah. Oh, hi, Hitman. Bye, Hitman. <laughs>Casey Parnell um, from High Caliber. How you doing today, Casey? I'm great. How are you? Okay, tell me, tell me about High Caliber. High Caliber, we are awesome. I think we're pretty underrated. We're a new team trying to figure things out, but we're taking on Southern Asylum today, and we are gonna bust them up something really good. Yes. Yes. Yeah, so I, I know our, our district has a, like a, a trash talking page, and I've seen a lot of stuff, and I'm looking forward to all that energy, excitement. Your team start. Uh, they get a lot of their energy and stuff from you. So what kind of, uh, what, what do we got in store today for them? Uh, we're gonna have a lot of talking. It's gonna be very loud. Um, my better half may or may not have a megaphone and he's gonna make it happen. And he's gonna be all up in their business and they're gonna crumble, they can't take it. Cause you know, we're, we're experienced and we like the trash talk. We like to travel to the other stuff and hear from the other teams and we're gonna give it out today. uh, DJ Skyrocket, uh, me and Clyde have uh, had many battles in the past. Uh, how you doing today, sir? I'm doing all right. Just waiting to get this action started. Right. So, how y'all doing this uh, tour season? How, how things coming along for you? Well, we had some bumps and bruises along the way, but we're gonna make a quick comeback after this night. Who y'all got? Who y'all got today? Oh, uh, we bowling the blind today, so we should be out here real quick. So I can head on back home. What's what's the rules for bowling the blind? What do you got to do? Uh, it's 10% uh, of your average, of your team average. So you got to bowl within 10% of your team average. So say if your team has 600, um, you got to bowl 540, 541 to win, 540 for the tie. Cool. So how many points you going to get today? I think we're going to get 40. 38, 38, anything under 38 is unacceptable. You know it, loud all the way. That's all we do. Yeah. You be here all day, you loud all day. All day loud, that's it. Tour stop here with uh, DSL's uh, Charles Withers, who is the Southeast Heavyweight Champ. Uh, Juice, I want to talk about the tour stop. How are y'all doing today in the, this uh, position round? Uh, game one is kind of a little iffy for us. We're kind of trying to catch the transition of the lanes quick. Uh, they're rolling the ball pretty good, so they're pretty much lined up. We're just going to let that game one go by, try to get back on it and strike as much as we can to get game two and three. Yep. So DSL is uh, number one right now in the district. You're number one in the WCS Southeast Heavyweight Champion. Uh, you get to bowl Ray Smith uh, next month in, uh, in Woodleaf. How you how you looking for that? How you, how's that going to go for you? Uh, I know Ray's pretty good bowler. Like I said, we're going to try to have a great match just like me and Sean did. Uh, he's on the left side, so I know the transition is going to be different for him. Well, you know, he has to worry about himself. I have to worry about myself. So we're just going to go there, try my best, retain the title, and may the winner go on the Mega Bowl.
So we're here with Joe from uh, Southern Asylum. Joe, um, tell me about what your experience has been so far in the UBA this season. Uh, it's actually been quite fun. Uh, I know uh, I've always been a big shit talker, so uh, getting the opportunity to not only bowl and shit talk at the same time. You suck, Joe. Thank you. Thank you, Turner. Uh, he thinks I suck, but uh, I do not suck. I actually, uh, I did beat him even in a lefty's house previously. So uh, just the fact that we get to bowl him and kick his ass again today after beating him in the first tour stop is quite an opportunity. Okay, so you, as a team, are you 